Hi, I'm Anthony Lauer, an R&D scientist at Miris Bio. Today, I will briefly describe the Transit Pro Transfection Kit for high-yield protein expression in suspension CHO and 293 cells. This transient transfection method enables drug discovery researchers to obtain sufficient protein for characterization and assay development within days as compared to the laborious process of stable cell line generation. The protocol is simple. To serum-free medium, add your plasma DNA and the Transit Pro transfection reagent. An optional ProBoost reagent may be added to the complex to increase protein expression in some media formulations. Allow complexes to form for 10 to 30 minutes. Then add the complexes to the culture vessel containing cells and incubate. No media change is required post-transfection. Harvesting times will vary depending on the protein and nature of the assay. Shown here is GFP expression two days post-transfection. Biotherapeutic proteins, such as secreted antibody constructs, expressed in this way are often assayed five to seven days post-transfection. For further details, please refer to the Transit Pro user protocol. Optimization of transfection conditions can further improve protein yields when using Transit Pro. The most important parameter is the ratio of transfection reagent to DNA. With the Transit Pro kit, we recommend a starting ratio of 1 microliter of the Transit Pro reagent and 0.5 microliter of the Pro Boost reagent per 1 microgram of plasmid DNA. It is ideal to test a small range of reagent to DNA ratios to determine the optimal levels for your specific cell type and media combination. The next critical parameter is media compatibility. Culture media can considerably affect transfection efficiency. Freestyle Cho S cells were adapted to five representative growth media. Cells were transfected on the same day with a plasmid encoding a human IgG1 construct using the Transit Pro and Pro Boost reagent. Titers varied significantly, supporting the importance of media formulation on protein expression. Many different culture vessels are available for suspension cell culture, including small scale deep well blocks, Erlenmeyer and two arm flasks, and large scale wave bags and bioreactors. For validated protein targets, scalability of transient protein production is often desirable. Linear protein expression yields have been observed using the Transit Pro Transfection Kit in culture volumes ranging from 4 to 400 milliliters. This graph depicts IgG1 antibody titers at 3, 5, and 7 days post-transfection in various size and types of culture vessels. No significant difference in protein yield is observed between transfections performed in cultures from 4 to 400 milliliters. Transfections using Transit Pro Transfection Kit have also been successfully performed using 4 liters of culture in a wave bioreactor. We hope that you have found this helpful. Additional experimental data and information can be found on our website, thetransfectionexperts.com. If you have any questions, please contact our scientific technical support team. Thank you.